Wedding month right here on Hallmark Channel. And to celebrate, we have invited the newly engaged couple Jesse Newark and Dan Fallman. And showing them how to make a DIY boho buffet table decor is Maria Provenzano. Hello, Maria. Welcome, you guys. And congratulations, Thank you. Thank you. What a so great much. moment in your life. It really is. Having. So I understand excited. you were set up by your My parents. mom and stepdad. They're matchmakers. They are <laughs> matchmakers, <laughs> <Yeah>. yes. <laughs> I was a little bit reluctant to it in the beginning. You know, mom, you don't know anything about my style in men. <laughs> and Joey, my stepdad, said, you guys have to meet. You have the same color eyes. And Aww. ever since I met him, it was, that was it. She, she knew it was a blind date. I didn't. He just comes up to me and says, what are you doing after work? Get to the hangar. I thought it was a business thing. I thought I was going to go meet another pilot. So I canceled dinner with my mom, you know, and, and met Jesse. And it's, we've been together ever since. But you did know? you, yeah. what, at first you were like trying to figure out what, what is she selling? Why am I? <laughs> I, I had no idea what was going on. So I was just like, oh, I got, I got nothing better to do after work. Sure. sure. Why not? Yeah. And then did you, how did you follow up with this? Did you go, hey, you want to go get a. I actually, pop? I took her for a walk around the airport. You know, I was like, hey, this is one of the planes I learned to fly in, you know, this is how we do it, and yeah. it's just, yeah. Did you then take her for a ride in the plane? No, I did. I did. Yeah, that would have been. <laughs> <laughs> like, deal. okay, I'm ready. Now we, we, have, we have gone flying since, but yeah. So yes. the wedding that you're up, you're planning is very unique. It's a bohemian yeah. style, right? Yes, mm -hmm. bohemian style, and we're trying to incorporate the aviation lineage as well, because my great-grandfather was a World War II Royal Air Force pilot, so, oh, and because he's a pilot yeah. as well. Oh, it's fantastic. just it's just kind of meant to be, you know. Wow, sure. My passion for aviation and her family history, you know, we just figured that the the Camarillo Airport would be the perfect venue for the wedding. So we're actually doing it um, in the hangar. They restore World War II airplanes, and I've always loved the P-51 Mustang, you know, World War II fighter for the American side. So we're gonna have one of those behind me at the altar, and then a. Uh, uh, Hawker, Hawker hurricane, hurricane, which is what her grandfather it's flew. It's a backdrop in that's that's exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Look at what? those yep. right there. Well, then yeah. you're going to love what we have in store for you here today. I can't wait. Yeah. <laughs> we say we, by the way. We, we mean Maria. <laughs> <laughs> by we, I mean we have nothing to do with it. Maria has done this You are all. my family. Yeah. Oh, thank, thank you. you. I, <laughs> okay, we're successful by association. Yes, exactly. So you can buy Maria aviation Oop. and boho sheep. As I kick the props? Yes. Yeah, so I talked to Jesse, and she loves everything that is rustic and casual and handmade and then I told her we would be best friends. So <laughs> after, and after that I kind of went with it and I really, since they're getting married in the airplane museum, we really wanted to incorporate the boho and the aviation and that was really the inspiration behind it and she's DIYing everything in her wedding. So she's been watching our show and mm -hmm. on Pinterest and yeah. getting crafty. And then, I mean, she's having 250 people oh my at her wedding. That so not gonna be she wanted to create yeah. a buffet Big family. Wow. for these 250 people. And we thought that would be a great place to do some amazing casual decor because she wants it casual enough to be able to have paper plates. Wait, are they all flying in? Some of them. Some of them. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, good, good. All right, so you were busier, right? Putting the table together? Yes, I was. I got busy that? this morning getting the table all set up, so I want you guys to take a look at how we got started. And that is our, our space. Maria, you want some <laughs> cool. So these are the crates that we actually rented. So you guys can buy or rent crates. They're, they're inexpensive and you can repurpose them. And then topped it with just some wood, a piece of wood that we painted to match it. And then you, you guys, we got these awesome parachutes. We got them from an army supply I love that. store that you can just get online cool. and or go into the store, whatever. And then we thought that it was a really great way to incorporate another texture into everything. So the silkiness of the parachutes and just really, really like in, including the aviation aspect mm -hmm. as well. Mm -hmm. And then moving up, we love the idea. So I worked with the amazing prop department here, headed by the mastermind of Dave Lowe. Dave so Lowe. they are, they were super helpful. And so then we wanted to keep everything casual. So we thought a great way to add some height would be these pots and pans and adding the silver that you see in the airplanes of as course. well. Yep. And so that's what gave it some height because you want that's height awesome. to really, really create an impressive decor. I mean, yeah, it's mm -hmm. not just the table. It's what's on top yeah. of it exactly. that makes it look the even detail. that. Yeah. The detail. So, and then including that detail, we took some wrapping paper maps and then wrapped them around uh, these 
just really tall vases. And then she loves baby's breath and peonies. So we want to incorporate that as well. And peonies, just uh, like just a note, they can be very expensive. So if you get faux peonies, you can repurpose them and use them all year oh, okay. long. And they're really, really idea. beautiful. Yeah. And then, of course, the map menu was really cool <laughs> as well. Uh, yeah. The uh -huh. aviation meets boho, of course. Absolutely and perfect. then something special. We wanted to really make sure you had the insignia for the P-51 Mustang and the Hawker Hurricane. So I made wow. these guys. You can see the other ones over the P-51s over there. And this is the Hawker Hurricane. See the eye mm -hmm. of the hurricane? Yep. Um, yep. And so <laughs> these are very important to you guys. I made these for you. They're you just wood pieces that I got from Michael's craft supply store. And they're painted and then used wood glue. And so you guys can incorporate them any way you can. Wow. Love it. So, Love it. So thank you so much. Thank you. So in typical men fashion, we don't we kind of let them take care of the business. I, right? I was told just show up and say yes. <laughs> right. But no, do you have any yeah. like if you had to I pick mean, something? I'm I'm pretty mellow and easygoing, you know, but I, I do kind of want something a little non-traditional with the music. You know, my father what? was a saxophone player, so uh -huh. if we could do something where he could do a set or something like that at the wedding and just yeah, like a that would be jazz yeah, yeah like a jazzy oh. type of feel did, yeah exactly it, and a song would be what like i got i got to go a little uh <laughs> <laughs> a little aviation dork on you, but um, I think we may do Frank Sinatra, Come Fly With Me. No, that would be like that. amazing. <laughs> That's a great song. Would it sound like this? She puts up with me. Would it sound like this? Yeah. Exactly. Right? Exactly. Exactly. Would it be a saxophonist maybe like this? This is Ryan Scalon. Yes. News for you. We here at Home and Family would like to provide you that band, that jazz oh, band that will be playing in a no, wonderful setting no, 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 thank you during thank your you, thank wedding. You, thank you so, so much. don't thank me. You gotta thank Woody for that.